MAN'S BEST FRIEND PROVES TO BE MAN'S BEST HELPER. TODAY, A RESCUED DOG TRAINED TO HELP THE HEARING IMPAIRED MEETS HER NEW OWNER IN OMAHA. KETV NEWS WATCH 7'S DAVID EARL HAS THE STORY. ARBA HERMAN'S HEARING HAS BEEN FAILING OVER THE YEARS. SHE'D MISS CALLS OR KNOCKS ON THE DOOR. BUT NOW, SHE'S GOT MAN'S BEST HEARING AID. GOOD, BELLA, YES. TODAY, SHE MEETS BELLA, A TWO-YEAR-OLD HOUND MIX TRAINED BY ROBERT COOLEY OF INTERNATIONAL HEARING DOGS INCORPORATED FROM COLORADO. THE DOGS ARE TRAINED TO LISTEN. SHE'S TRAINED IN THREE BASIC SOUNDS, THE DOOR, THE TELEPHONE, THE SMOKE ALARM. For example, in case that smoke alarm isn't loud enough, at night, when Bella hears this sound, she'll jump up on Arva's bed and wake her up. If it were any other sound, Bella would then jump off the bed and go to that source of the sound. If she stays on the bed, that's how Arva knows that it's the smoke detector. Bella gets around the house easy, pointing out cell phone calls to her new owner or suspicious sounds. The pair even go on trips out of the house, like to the grocery store. Having her out in public gives me the opportunity to meet other people who are hearing impaired that do not know about the hearing dog program. Maybe not as well known as seeing eye dogs for the blind or PTSD dogs for soldiers returning from war, hearing dogs also provide a valuable service. And the $8,000 of training for each dog the group matches with a person who needs help, paid for completely by donations. She's just going to be tremendous help, and she's very, very attentive, as you can see. In Omaha, David Earl, KETV News Watch 7. If you want to help make these matches possible, you can get in touch with the local Lions Club. They can connect you with International Hearing Dogs, Inc., and we have posted all of that information online at KETV.com.